Hi, I'm Pauline Conley, and I'm talking to Kay Barchetti with Caldwell Banker. And Kay is a top real estate agent, and she is known to be an expert at selling homes which are difficult to sell. She has a reputation in Pittsburgh to be the person to go to if you're having trouble selling your home. And Kay knows what sells and how to position a, sell, a home to sell. And right now, we're talking about if you have a home and you're thinking about selling, because Kay, you told me that the average person stays in a home only about five years. So when you're working on your home, even if you're not thinking you're going to sell it, you know that eventually you will. You're going to be making choices about flooring in your home. And um, we would like to talk about which room is the most important in a room and what choices you should make. Well, I don't know what room is the most important to people, but I know what room is the most important to buyers. Mm -hmm. um, once the home's on the market, the very first thing is the kitchen. And I think more and more as people entertain at home more, everyone congregates in the kitchen. And I hear that every day and every night. So the kitchen's important. And in the Pittsburgh market, I have found that in homes up to about 249,000, it can be three things. It can be a vinyl floor, a laminate floor, and a hardwood floor. And from 150 to 249, the closer you get to 249, the more they're wanting hardwood. Now from 249 to maybe 3, 399, <laughs> it's going to be hardwood or ceramic tile. Hopefully not white ceramic tile. Mm. It's impossible to keep it perfect. And with people working and being so busy, they're wanting floors that'll look better and stay cleaner. Hardwood is marvelous for that. And then in the ceramic tiles now, they have so many of these tan and mottled stones that look wonderful, even if you're only going to go over them once a week. Now you go from 349, 400,000 and up, they want exotic hardwoods, Brazilian cherries, or they want limestone, sandstone, natural stones, inserts, but all exotics. So there's all different price points, but it's the kitchen. And second, ties, master bedroom, and then family room. Family room is more important in the home where they're not even doing a formal living room anymore. And for about 10 years, people have been doing that custom building. Now even some spec homes are being done without a formal living room. Who uses them anymore? Remember, our parents used to have plastic on the furniture. Well, our generation didn't do that, but we really don't use them. So, so many people now are having a den because of all the home offices now. And then they're having a huge family room. Hardwood again comes into play because you can have area rugs that separate the areas. It's usually open to the kitchen now, so you have that eat-in kitchen area, so there's one rug there. Opens up to the kitchen while mom's cooking, she's watching that they're doing the homework and they can see the TV from there, maybe the game's on, whatever. And then you'll have a more casual area as it moves in toward the rest of the house. So I find in whatever room you put, put the most money in the floor. Paint's the most important when you get in your house ready to sell. Number one, two would be the floors. So people look at the most. Okay, thank you.